Hey guys, what's up, what's up, Wasabi? I'm Eric Surf 6 and this is your ticket to tomorrow, to the future. I am back again at this automated kiosk. There are no humans inside the shop. It's fully automated. It uses camera sensors. There they are, the camera sensors on the ceiling. There's, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, 10, 15, 20, it looks like. Yeah, 20 sensors on the ceiling. So you get in using your IC card. This is a prepaid train card. And you scan it at the beginning, and then you scan it at the end. That's it. On this episode, I'm going to buy just one item and see how fast I can get in and out of the store. I did it before in about, I think it was about 12 seconds. At this time, I think I can shave that down to under 10. I'm gonna go for like eight seconds. Just one item. All right, here we go. From start to finish. Let's see if I can, this is probably the world's fastest transaction ever. Not using a human. All right, here we go. Okay, how fast was that? It's just for fun. Let's see how long it takes to buy something at a convenience store, right? Timing. It's not busy. I think I can be the first one to the cashier. Okay, here we go. Going in. And out. Stop. Stop the clock. How fast was that? So what was I thinking at that last convenience store? I should have used this, not cash, obviously. That's going to take longer. My bad. This time we're going in with the IC card. One item, scan the card, see how long it takes. Got to do it when there's no line now. Good timing, ready and go. Okay. Hi, come on. And out, how was that? That worked for you guys? To be honest, it was much easier and a more relaxing type of situation in the AI store with no humans. But then again, I mean, I was trying to go fast, so, you know, it creates a bit of a stressful situation for the clerk, perhaps. I needed to wait for the receipt, but, uh, yeah, whatever. It's all good. Okay, to summarize my little experiment, as you saw, it takes 12 seconds to do the AI store transaction. That was the fastest that I could do. It just takes so long to process the card and to spit out that receipt. 12 seconds was the fastest. At a convenience store using the IC card, same time, 12 seconds with a live clerk. So that's pretty impressive for a store. But side note, that transaction took three tries with the clerk. We had to kind of practice it. So the first two times it was way longer. So I, it's a bit of a cheat. It is possible, but that's not the amount of time you're normally going to get. And then, of course, you saw the cash transaction. That takes three times as long as either the AI store or using the IC card at a convenience store. And finally, it's time to announce the winners of the giveaway from the AI store part two. So three of them. There's going to be three winners. Let's have another look at the products here. And also, I discovered an error. Yes, there are a total of 11 items here that I bought. I brought three of each, so therefore three packs. This is the receipt right here. And on the receipt, there are only 10 items, right? 10 different types of items times three, right? That's the quantity. So... Basically, they missed one of these items, and upon further review, it was the very first item that I bought. This one right here, the Sembe Crackers. So I got three of these for free. They sell for 120 yen each, so I owe the JR, Japan National Railway Company, about $3.50. Yeah. So, yeah. It's not, it's not a perfect system. So let's get on to announcing the winners here. Okay, 
these boxes are, are loaded and ready to go. This stuff will go in here. So it's 11 items and also there is a personalized letter for me and some other goodies inside the envelope. Okay. So the winners are, the winners are, let me get out my notes here. There were over 2,300 comments on this video. The AI store video number two. And the winners are, winner number one of a get some snack pack special edition AI store Japan is Thomas Lance. Congratulations to you, Thomas. Winner number two of a Get Some Snack Pack Special Edition from the AI Store Japan is Kate Tubb. Congratulations to you, Kate. And the final winner of the Special Edition Get Some Snack Pack AI Edition. How many times am I going to say it? That was the last time. The winner is the last and final winner. All this is going to your box. The winner is Scott Kramer. So congratulations to all of the winners. If you're one of the winners, email me at ericsurf6 at gmail.com. For the final part of this video, I'm gonna say goodbye from the train station platform. I do have some final words. There has been an update. The JR Japan Railway Company has issued a statement that if this technology is successful, this is a trial period, that they will open 3,000 stores in the Tokyo metropolitan area. So there you go. Interesting bit of news there for you guys. If you're not familiar, I also do a food series on Wednesdays and Saturdays. It's called Eric Meal Time. So if you guys are into food, check out that series as well. The Monday series is a random video on trying out new programming towards the end of the year and for 2019. So there'll be vlogs, there'll be like top six lists, bunch of different types of things that I try out on this Monday video. So thank you guys for watching. See you next time.